In India, there is one state where patients do have access to morphine, a state called Kerala. Here, patients like Susie, who has a form of cancer called multiple myeloma, have ready access to morphine pills. She's on 10 milligrams of morphine every four hours. She's pain-free most of the time, and that now she is able to sleep. And Dr. M. R. Rajagopal can even write the family a prescription for morphine pills, so they can control her pain on their own. The vast majority of patients, the first time we see them, that can be horrendous. But usually, by the time we are ready to make the second or third visit, very often, they have changed, they are smiling now. They are also eternally thankful for what little we are able to do for them. He says earlier he was unable to walk, he was bedbound and he could walk only with two people supporting him. But now he is able to walk a bit. These patients have access to painkillers because for years Dr. Rajagopal has been working on convincing the state government to simply loosen its narcotics rules. In Kerala, things got changed because we together built a system of getting the low-cost morphine powder from the government factory, making low-cost morphine and having it available. And the bureaucracy, particularly the drug controller of Kerala and his office, responded positively to that. And Dr. Rajagopal struck a deal with the Indian pharmaceutical maker Cipla to make inexpensive morphine for his clinics. The little that Cipla is doing is purely, purely humanitarian. It is not a business. So I would strongly suggest that uh, the government of India takes this up more as a challenge and, 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 and distribute morphine tablets. Now, morphine is even made in bulk, right at the regional cancer hospital in Kerala. So patients with excruciating tumors can lie quiet. Children with cancer can at least enjoy their afternoons in comfort. But the improvements in India are only in the tiny state of Kerala. There are still 27 other states in India where access to morphine is still limited at best or simply non-existent. <laughs>